Hey guys, Dr. Carey here. It is lunchtime. I'm going to make a healthy smoothie um, to kind of get me through the day and to keep my nutrition on track. Often patients ask me, what should I be eating? Uh, what do you eat? And I wrote about um, my diet in this book called The 100 Day Diet, where I lost 32 pounds in 100 days by doing a lot of research and finding the answers. So today I'm going to show you a healthy smoothie. Now I just got this Ninja Blender, so it's brand new. And uh, I just washed the container, so we're ready to go to make this. And I've got my scale out, so it's really important for you to have a scale and to know what you're putting in your food. So I'm just going to zero that out. And then what I'm going to do is take the container right here, and I'm going to zero out the scale with the container on it. And I'm going to add my base. Now, I love macadamia nut milk right here. This one is somewhat sweetened. It's not unsweetened. So it's one cup as 70 calories and there's the nutritional component. Now, depending on what type of diet you're on and what um, foods you're eating, you might want the sweetened one or you could use something like this. This is almond milk that's unsweetened that only has 30 calories per cup. Today, I'm going to use the sweetened one, the, the macadamia nut milk. Macadamia nuts are the healthiest oils, so I'm going to use that. I'm just going to shake it up a little bit, and then I'm going to put in 250 milliliters uh, into the smoothie, and that's going to be one serving. So there we go, 250. And once you open it, you want to uh, refrigerate that. And that's going to be my base. Now the next thing I'm going to do is take this um, organic fruit blend. Now one a serving of this is 113 grams and it has 70 calories. And I'm going to add this to my food log. I use Carb Manager for that. Um, so I'm going to add that at the end of the uh, day just so I know what foods I've eaten. So I've zeroed my scale and I'm going to put 113 grams of these berries into my smoothie. So just nice and easy here. Uh, get a mixture of that. That's 25. 35. And sometimes I'll do half a portion depending on what time of the day it is, but I'm pretty hungry right now. I did exercise a lot yesterday, so and I've been intermittent fasting. So um, this is kind of my first big meal of the day, and I want to make sure I get the full nutritional component to it. 113 right there. So I'm going to put that down. I'm just going to wash this off because it gets a little bit messy and you want to be close to a sink if you're at work so that you don't make too much of a mess. Now, I got this pumpkin protein from the nutritional store uh, close by to the office and one scoop has 90 calories in it. So I'm going to use one scoop of this pumpkin protein, which I love, in this uh, smoothie and there's one scoop right there. Just going to put that in, okay? And that's a full serving of the protein. Fish oil. I've got these omega-3 fish oils by Nutri-C. One serving is five uh, milliliters. I'm going to zero the scale out, and I'm going to put five milliliters in there of fish oil, which is omega-3 fatty acid. Now, call me crazy, but I'm going to put five milliliters of olive oil and this is organic extra virgin olive oil. I'm going to put five milliliters because the oil from olives is different from the oil from fish and most people uh, don't get enough healthy oils in their diet. So if there's any really important tips from today, healthy protein, healthy oils, really important. Five milliliters of extra virgin olive oil into the smoothie. Now, It'll change the taste a little bit, not as much as you think, but it's going to be really good for your body to have those monounsaturated fats in your smoothie. I've got all that. I think we're good to go. So what I'm going to do is put the lid on it. Now you can add some fiber. In subsequent videos, I will get some chia seeds or some fiber and add it to the smoothie. But for today, just wanted to keep it simple. Let's see how this Ninja works. I'm going to shake it up a little bit. 
and this is my first time using the Ninja, so let's see how the Ninja works. So there we go, there's my smoothie. Now I'm gonna transfer this to a container with the lid on it. So I'm just gonna take the, the uh, blades off, rinse those off. Here's my lid, I'm gonna put my lid on there. And I am good to go for the next little bit with my healthy smoothie. If you have any questions, please let me know. I will put the ingredients list into uh, the show notes here on YouTube. And uh, please follow me if you want more tips on nutrition, healthy habits, healthy lifestyle. It is something that uh, I've studied and I do recommend to my patients here in the clinic.